Across the country, people are getting ready to celebrate the holidays this week. Health officials are worried about a potential increase in positive COVID-19 cases if people don't follow CDC guidelines. Weather Duane's Grace Campbell shares what two Huntsville paramedics endured when they had the coronavirus. Jean Humphrey and David Drake are two young and seemingly healthy paramedics. They initially thought they'd feel fine if they were to get the coronavirus. But that wasn't the case. It hit me like a ton of brick. I would uh, liken it to uh, being tortured um, just in terms of the, the body pain. Uh, it was very excruciating. Humphrey says the first symptom she experienced was being short of breath. Her symptoms later escalated to feeling too weak to leave bed. I hurt everywhere from head to toe. Like David said, muscle aches, I've never felt that in my whole entire life. Uh, but it's incredibly lonely and you're extremely isolated. And uh, for me, just at you know my young age, it was hard. Humphrey says she suffered with fatigue for two months after she tested negative for the coronavirus. Drake tested positive for the virus in November. He felt severely sick for three weeks and his health is still not back to normal. You could be a 70 year old with a COPD and a heart condition and you could be fine. Or you could be a 21 year old bodybuilder and it could uh, end up putting you in the hospital or worse, it can kill you. Drake says the coronavirus seems to affect people severely at random. So it's important to protect yourself and others from the virus by wearing masks and practicing social distancing. In Huntsville, Grace Campbell, Way 31 News.